This land is your land, this land is my land, from California to the New York Islands, from the Redwood Forests to the Gulf Stream waters. This land was made for you and me, as I went walking that ribbon of highway, I saw saw below me that golden valley this land was made for you and me this assembly is convened to commemorate the 234th anniversary of the signing of the united states constitution September 17th, 2021 marks the 234th anniversary of the signing of the Constitution of the United States of America by the Constitutional Convention, whereas it is fitting and proper during this week to accord official recognition to this magnificent document, its memorable anniversary, and the patriotic celebrations which will commemorate it and whereas the Constitution of the United States of America, the guardian of our liberties, embodies the principles of limited government in a republic dedicated to freedom, equality, and the rule of law, and whereas it is an American privilege to commemorate the anniversary of the Constitution of the United States with appropriate ceremonies and activities and whereas lost rights may never be regained, and it is our civic duty to uphold, protect, and defend the Constitution and the freedoms it guarantees to all our fellow Americans. Now, therefore, I, Greg Gianforte, Governor of the State of Montana, do hereby proclaim September 17th through the 23rd, 2021, to be Constitution Week in Montana to reaffirm the ideals of the framers of the Constitution and celebrate our freedoms that the Constitution protects. Thank you so much for joining us to celebrate the United States Constitution. Aside from the Bible, the United States Constitution is the most important document in America's history. Freedom, God-given rights, structure of our government, checks and balances, and it is the law of the land. I appreciate the Orofina chapter's efforts to ensure that our community shares this importance every year during Constitution Week. By taking part in the electoral process, we choose the leaders of tomorrow and put our state and country on the path for the future. Respect your right to vote. Participating in free and fair elections is a privilege not offered in many other countries. So be responsible, be informed, and be the voice your vote allows you to be. What portion of the Constitution is the most celebrated? The Bill of Rights, probably, right? People talk about rights. We uphold these rights because we know that power corrupts and metastasizes, and we therefore seek to limit concentrations of power. And that's because we know intuitively that there are spheres of life that belong to us, belong to our families, to our churches, our communities, and not to the government. The twilight's last gleaming, whose bronze stripes and bright... On behalf of State Superintendent Elsie Aronson, happy Constitution Day. Our social study standards, which had not been revised in 20 years, are now updated. They took effect July 1st and helped bring attention to increased opportunities for civics education in grades K through 12. The updated standards detail the knowledge base that students should progressively obtain in each year of schooling. 
The civics and government portions emphasize the use of primary documents like the Constitution to allow for greater critical thinking skills. Finally, this afternoon, under the guidance of the Youth Vote Act, we're excited to announce a new and improved Montana Youth Vote Program. Our new website, civics.sosmt.gov, offers resources to get students engaged and becoming knowledgeable citizens to help them become informed voters of the future. We're also excited to announce the U.S. Constitution Contest. What does the Constitution mean to me? This contest is open to all Montana students and is a great opportunity to encourage our youth to discuss the importance of the document by which this country was founded.